The carving work on the perimeter wall of the Iraivan temple continues in Bengaluru. Satguru Bodhinatha Velan Swami and Sanyasan Shanmuganatha Swami visited the carving site in August to review the progress. After meeting with members, devotees, and students, they spent four days at Kailash Ashram participating in ceremonies for the recently dedicated Rajagopuram. The house where the stone carvers live while they are on Kauai is getting an upgrade. Aditya Vinadhara and his associate Bob Stokes flew in from Salt Lake City to renovate drywall, paint walls and ceilings, and install new light fixtures, kitchen appliances, and cabinetry. To be in touch with his far-flung community of devotees more frequently, Bodhinatha has begun conducting webinars. His first session in September was on the microcosm, the inner part of man. This experiment was a grand success with participants in Australia, Singapore, Malaysia, and India. Acharya Aramuganatha Swami and Sadaka Jayanatha traveled to Boulder, Colorado to participate in the Uberoi Foundation conference held at the Naropa University. The foundation has been consistently supportive of the monastery's work in the field of Hindu education, providing a grant which made possible the 23-minute video, The History of Hindu India, and its sequel, which is currently in the scripting stage. See the video at the URL on screen. Paramacharya Sadashivanatha Swami and Sanyasin Santil Nathaswami traveled to Orlando, Florida for the ninth annual North American Hindu Mandir Executives Conference. Sadashivanatha Swami presented on the broader impact of HMEC in the evolution of the consciousness of Americans regarding Hindu thought, history, and culture, offering ideas to the group on how they might move forward in the decades ahead. Sentil Nathaswamy was asked to speak on how the monastery produces content, and his presentation took the group through the conception, photo and art collecting, writing, proofing, and design processes. They also visited Loveland, Colorado, America's foremost sculpting and bronze casting region, to see how our Iraivan Temple Builder's Tribute is being made. A day-long tour of the four major shops that are involved in the making of the bronze statues proved a quick introduction to artistic metalwork, from wax model to mold, casting to chasing, patina to packing, and shipping. The Swamis documented the process for future visitors to the tribute, and the many craftsmen and women were honored at a special event. With the Media Studio construction project nearing completion, the monastery's website has been getting some attention. New educational insight pamphlets, valuable resources for parents and teachers, can now be downloaded at the URL on screen. Some vintage talks, true gems from Gurudeva circa 1962, can now be heard as well. Mm-hmm.